just as Canada's auto sector seemed to be cruising, a bump in the road has some workers fearing trouble ahead. Well, that would be an economic disaster for this region. It could go up in smoke. Across town from the Windsor assembly plant churning out Chryslers, parent company Stellantis has paused much of the work to build a new electric vehicle battery plant. The multinational telling CBC News the Canadian government has not delivered on what was agreed to, so all construction related to the battery module production on the Windsor site has stopped. My stomach fell a little bit. Uh, this is a pretty serious move uh, by Stellantis. The new plant is supposed to generate 2,500 jobs, with Ottawa and Ontario kick-starting the project last year by together contributing a billion dollars. So yes, we put up a lot of money. But the federal government recently pledged up to a whopping 13 billion in a separate mega deal with Volkswagen. We need the uh, federal government to step up. Uh, as they did for Volkswagen. All this prime minister does is wrap our industry in red tape, weigh them down in taxes. The city has seen expected jobs vanish before. 20 years ago, Chrysler dropped plans to assemble this small pickup in Windsor. We want to see the federal government follow through on commitments, get this plant built to make sure those jobs are there for Windsor. Now Ottawa is under added pressure with Washington offering major subsidies to EV battery makers. All of it leading the finance minister to stress Canada's means aren't unlimited. And we are counting on Ontario to do its fair share and we're counting on Stellantis to be reasonable. The federal government says it's still negotiating with Stellantis. Neither side is saying how much additional money is needed to keep the Windsor project alive. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Toronto.